Welcome back, true believers. This is Rakdar, and we are about to do what we've been waiting to do our whole life. We're gonna do the wing ceremony so we can um, date Princess Zelda. And here's our best friend, Bruce. Well, well, if it isn't Rakdar. Word around the plaza is you found that dumb bird of yours. Well, that's just great, because you and your dumb bird can't tell time. All the prey race warm-ups. We've been waiting forever for the race to start. Did they delay it for you? I don't get it. The big flake gets special treatment. You're almost a man, and yet you still can't seem to go anywhere without Zelda. I bet you can't even decide what to have for lunch on your own, huh? And you don't think we haven't noticed the smug looks? Ooh, Zelda and I are best friends. We go everywhere together. Ugh. You think you're pretty suave, don't you? Well, don't you? Bruce has been going on forever about how he's gonna be the one to be with Zelda. He's really got his pompadour and a ruffle of beard. Durr I hate to break it to you, but today's the day I bust up your adorable fantasy land you're loving in. Zelda's playing the role of the goddess at today's ceremony, and I'm gonna be the one to take off my loincloth. When I heard she's made it herself, man, there's no way I'm gonna let some scrawny clown snatch the prize from me. Oh yes, that sailcloth, Zelda's sailcloth, will be mine, duh ha ha! Oh man, I bet she was thinking about me when she was stitching it. Yup, I can see it now. First, I win the big race, and then Zelda and I finish the ceremony on the statue. It'll be our special moment alone. Nobody is stopping me and Zelda from having our moment. I can see it now. <laughs> Gruce, pst! Gruce, pst! Behind you, right behind you! What, can't you two see I'm in the middle of something? Good. Yeah. Care to explain just what you mean by our special moment alone? Uh, yeah, nothing big, really. Just, uh, Rakdar, yeah, I was just telling your buddy I was glad he found the red bird of his. Boy, am I looking forward to a fair race. Anyhow, later, Zelda, look for me during the race. I'll be the one pulling off all the dangerous moves. I'll be the one winning. <laughs> hey, Groose, wait up! Who had the old Jewish- oh, I remember. The old Jewish mother was the Pippet. No, it was the other guy. I forget his name. Did you hear that guy? A fair race? Yeah, the chances of that happening are just less than zero. Either way, don't let those fools get you down, Rakdar. Just get out there and fly the best you can. I know you've got these guys beaten. Deep down, I think you do too. Us? <laughs> I'm trying to do the worst answers, but like, it doesn't make a difference in this game. It's not like it's Fable or anything. The wing ceremony will begin. Participating students, please assemble. Looks like it's race time. Good luck, Rakdor. Rak, 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 there. Attention, please, and we're ready to the wing ceremony. I was beginning to worry that we'd uh, to proceed with that rack time, but luckily it is no longer a concern. I'm glad you could all make it. Before we start, I'll explain the rules for today's competition. I've attached a small statute, statuette, as it were. Who then will release this guy? As a buzz signal, press A to dash and dive off the ledge once you're in the air. Bound your loft wing, that's disgusting. Remember to call your boat properly with down and dive off the edge. Whoever catches the bird claims the statuette with A will be this year's champion. Those are the rules, simple enough. I should think, but do you need to hear them again? Absolutely not. Mm. Excellent. As you are low, today's champion will graduate to the next class, bringing one step closer to the edge, and I'm about to break everything you say to me. Please, I hate that song. You will also receive a gift from the young woman to play the goddess in this year's ritual. Today is a special day for many reasons, but it's also the 25th anniversary of our finest. It's, it's fourth walls get broken, but he's talking about the 25th. Ceremony, not the 25th year of Zelda, which was, in fact, last year. It was the 25th anniversary. <laughs> the lovely Zelda! <laughs> is, is she the one who said that? Did she say that herself? They queued that up really well. We are finishing each other's sandwiches. Just show me how hard you've been practicing. Oh, the, he's laughing. Clean flag. Anyone read it here with the riders? This is your answer to me. That goes double for you, Bruce. Hey! Alright, gentlemen, line up at my command. The competition will begin. Ooh, I'm gonna kick these guys' booties. Woo, uh, dash, jam, and oh, this is so cool! I'm gonna fly. I'm gonna get my bird before these guys even touch their bird. All right, cool. 
I'm ready to get my fly on. Lots of opening, you know, there's lots of cutscenes. All right, we gotta do this, and then, oh yeah. Shwing! There's been a lot of cutscenes in this, uh, in the opening of this game, which, I, I, you know, it's kind of like, it's hard to do the commentary thing when there's, oh, okay. We're already passing them up. Oh, I think I got it. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, oh man. Whew. Where is that stupid bird? Alright, oh, go down. See, the problem is I'm, I'm too good at this. That's not true, I'm actually... Alright, oh, yeah! Oh, I got that statue! Hey, don't you know this is my day to get all the glory? I was... Is it gonna keep going? I think he's gonna, like, rape me or something. Hey, you heard him, let's get this fly on egg on your face. Oh, no! I can fly with egg on my face. Oh. So, wait, so I have to dodge the eggs? Okay. Okay. That ain't a thing. I wonder if they damage me. I don't know. I'm probably not even gonna get hit with one because I'm just... Oh, that bird is turning his bitch ass around. Cool. Okay. We can do this. We can do this. I caught him once. I can catch him again. Cool. Flying in this game is actually really fun. It's a lot more fun once you get to the points where you actually, like, get to fly. Alright. Oh. Alright, we just gotta get behind him. Hope he doesn't turn. Get my things back. Alright, here we go. Ooh. Oh, wait, oh, I have to hit A to catch it. My bad. I didn't realize because the first time it triggered the scene, so I wasn't sure how all that worked. Nope, oh, there we go. Oh, I got it. They can't do. Their eggs did nothing to me. See? Bird statuette. It proves victory. Wait till Zelda sees this. Trying to prove yourself to a girl? Not a good idea, really. <laughs> Women, right? You have to get bird statues. Every girl I've ever dated, I've had to catch a bird statue from some loft wing just to get her harp jump into my sack. Just to get her to jump my bones. I had to catch a bird statue from a loft wing. Don't worry, in coin. <laughs> Great flowing, Rakdar. Congratulations. Congratulous. Now we'd better get on with the sermon. Sermon. With the ceremony. Ceremonials of bed. <laughs> Hand me the bird's edge, right? Grab the race. I must offer to the goddess. Great goddess, God in light and protector of our people, grant us your blessing and mercy as I act in your stead during this ceremony. Valiant youth, two brass victory at the celebration of poor folk in accordance with the old ways, I now bestow the blessing of the goddess upon you. <gasps> She's taken off her sail. That's disgusting. This is a kid's this is a family name. The blessings of the goddess drift down from the heavens aloft the sail, which I now pass to you. Well, you got the sailcloth, and you can drift pretty height without fear of painful landing. It smells nice, too. That's kind of creepy, but it's, it's, uh, you know, that's how things are. That's not that creepy. Right? Remember? You know, they say the goddess gave the sailcloth. <laughs> the sailcloth is a B card. Of course, the one you're holding the same one. I've been working finished to make the sailcloth the same time. You say, I'm really glad I got to give it to you, Raptor. Make sure you take good care of it, okay? I really like the music right here. Thanks for making it up here, so... Uh, to do this, with, like, promise track there. Sorry, I just, like, lost my train of thought. <laughs> I really should finish this ritual. You do know what happens at the end, right? Uh-oh. <laughs> just what are you thinking? Don't be silly. This is your big moment, Ragnar. 
She's, spoiler alert, she's not gonna kiss me. In fact, she's gonna try and kill me. You have to jump off the statue! Look down, see that big round design in the courtyard below? To finish the ceremony, you need to drop down right into the center of it. Leap off the edge here right before you hit the ground. Press B to open up the sailcloth. Just how brave are you? If you were really fearless, you'd wait until the last second to use your sailcloth so ready to jump. I absolutely love the this part of the game. I'm just gonna say right now, the whole, like, skydiving thing in this game is so cool. And I am gonna wait till the last second because I want to be cool. I want to be cool. Cool. Did I look cool enough? I don't think I did. I think I looked pretty cool. <sighs> that was perfect. You're amazing, Rector. <gasps> you know, Rector, seeing as how you won today. And with the weather being so nice, you think maybe you'd like to go fly around the clouds together? <laughs> Rector, hey Rector! Today was amazing, watching you win the race and performing the ritual together, I'll always remember this. It really was wonderful. <laughs> you know, Ragdar, there's something I've been meaning to talk to you about. What is that? <laughs> 